For version 3.2 of the Getting Things Done Outlook add-in, we've added two new features to the Create Report function. The first new feature allows the user the option to sort tasks by project as well as due date, action, status, and order. Select a project from Project Central and click Project Menu, Create Report, or right-click on the selected project to select Create Report from the Context Menu. The Report Setup dialog box appears. Under Options, the Sort Task by Drop List now has a subproject listed. Select Subproject from the drop list and click OK. The print report is displayed and the tasks are listed alphabetically by subproject. Neat Toe. Also brand spanking new to the Create Report function is Completion Date of Tasks. Many users have asked for the completion date of tasks to be added to the print report. However, there was never enough room to print all the task columns on the report. For version 3.2, we've added a new view to create your report and display completion dates for tasks. Select a project from Project Central and click Project Menu Create Report or right-click on the selected project to select Create Report from the Context Menu. The Report Setup dialog box appears and you'll notice a new drop list called Orientation. This drop list will change the paper orientation from Portrait, which is the default, to Landscape and allow you to see the completion dates of tasks on the report. Under View or Print, select Landscape and under Options, make sure the Show Completed Tasks is selected. Click OK. The report is displayed in Landscape mode and the completion date column is displayed in the tasks. If your task has been marked as complete, a date will appear in the completion column. If your task is not marked complete, no date will appear in this column. Those are the handy new features for the Create Report function.